Alright, what is going on YouTube? It's your boy Spanko. Okay, I will say this. I'm starting this vlog exactly where I ended yesterday's vlog, but it's gonna be really fun. Today is day two of the YCS. They just announced the top 64. That's really, really cool. Congratulations to everyone who top. Who decided to try hard in the main event? I respect it. They got to the top 64. It's very, very tough. I rate every single one of them. But I will say this. We are currently in line to get some stuff signed by Jaden and Yuki. Then we're gonna be in the token line so we can get a group token. That's gonna be really, really fun. And then the Jaden and Yuki versus Astro Phoenix duel is gonna happen. I wanna get some footage of that because I'm super hyped for that. Then the rest of the day, we're honestly gonna be chilling and trading around around just doing what we do you know having a good time now i will say in today's video my voice is kind of gone from all the yelling and all the talking we've been doing for this whole weekend especially over the loud noises and whatnot so i'm gonna be taking it a little bit slow today but i will have a good time regardless i'm gonna show you guys as much as i can it's gonna be a shorter vlog maybe but today's gonna be a really good day and uh then we're gonna end off the national so i appreciate every single one of y'all i'm gonna keep you guys updated and i'll get back to you whenever well, something happens i guess So as you guys ended up seeing, I actually got the playmat signed by Jaden, which is really nice. Alpha waited in line for me. I appreciate it so much. Soon they're gonna be doing the Jaden versus Astro Live duel, and that's what I'm really excited for. The guys were chilling over there while I was doing some trades, and uh, it's gonna be held on that stage right over there. Man, that stage is so pretty. I'm so excited for this. It's like my childhood dreams, watching Jaden and Astro Live. That's so crazy. <laughs> <laughs> We're actually just sitting there T-posing And they noticed us They noticed us T-posing <laughs> This is hilarious And it just looks like he doesn't know us He just associated Get your game on Yo, okay, so you guys just saw the Jaden Yuki duel happen. I can't believe I got to watch that live. That was actually one of the most crazy experiences of my life. To watch Jaden say, get your game on. To watch him say, that's game. That's so crazy to me. I didn't think I would ever see it happen, but it happened. I don't know. I'm like a little kid right now. My heart's racing. That was so fun. But I really want to just say something real quick. And I got to have the chance and the opportunity to talk to Megan Capital G here for the last maybe 20 or 25 minutes. And honestly, that guy has taught me so much. I love talking to him. Hopefully, I don't know about him, but I consider him a friend now. Shout out Megan Capital G if you're watching this video. I really appreciate your words. I really enjoyed hanging out with you, man. And I even told him, I was like, man, listen, I'm a fan, but I want to be a peer. You know what I mean? That's the kind of energy and the motivation that i have i know you guys can probably barely hear me because like my voice is gone but to be honest with you i'm having such a great event and i know this whole time i've been talking about how great the event was but i do want to say that just enjoy everything you guys do every experience you guys get make sure to make the most out of it because really this is the happiest i've been in so long and that's literally just because i've taken this time and i've taken this event to really just meet people and do what i love doing the most Forget playing Yu-Gi-Oh! Just the Yu-Gi-Oh! community is so great. So really I just want to say appreciate everything you guys have. And if you have these opportunities, 
don't let him go to waste. With that being said though, I don't know where any of my friends are because I was literally with Kat for the last like 30 minutes, like I said, so I gotta go find out where they are. I just wanna say a big shout out to all our Canadian players. Like this is kind of crazy. So you guys are gonna see, or at this point may have already seen, that one of my good friends, Deep, you guys have probably seen him on the channel. He actually came top 16 at the Nationals. We have Rayhan, one of my friends that you guys definitely see in the vlog. We always call him out, YCS champ, Rayhan Saeed. Rayhan went top 32. We got some Canadians in top eight right now. Shout out Canada, bro. Canada's going hard at this event. It's crazy to me that like, I I've been with these guys for so long and I can see the come up like that. So for me, I'm very proud of them. Rayhan, if you're watching this deep, if you're watching this, Ryan, Steven, all those guys are in the top right now. All of you guys, James Kim actually went top 64, I believe as well. So big names, big guys, shout out Canada. I gotta go still find the guys though. I have no idea where my friends are. I stopped to talk to the top cut guys and I wanted to congratulate them personally. I love those guys, you know, I love the team, I love the guys. Bro, this event room is so huge by the way. Like it's so hard to walk back and forth, but I'll probably find something to do and then we'll go from there. Boys, we just made a crazy deal. This guy right here pulled up with a holy grail card. Like the shining flaming man, you guys know how long I've been looking for this. And he raided me. Absolute. <laughs> Yeah, absolute I, rated me I but i'm i'm never gonna let go of this thank you so much yeah, for this i appreciate no problem, it bro. of course thank no you problem. guys i just literally made the deal of a lifetime and i got ransacked i got you guys saw it i got ransacked literally my whole binder all the ulties all the secrets all the pretty stuff all got ransacked so it's the end of uh day two i guess congratulations like i said to all the guys who taught all the canadians all the americans too shout out to you guys but i just want to say you know big up to canada this is what the event room looks like post uh it's main event pretty much the main event's done there's a couple guys still left at top cut because i think they're doing they're either at top four or they're at finals but regardless you guys can see like this entire room that was full for a full weekend a whole weekend where everyone's just crashing into each other they're all busy it's empty now i'm not gonna end the vlog off here what i'm actually gonna do is i'm probably gonna go back to the hotel end it off there i want to show you guys all the pickups i want to show you guys everything that i did this weekend was amazing. Thank you guys all for watching this whole time. I'm so low energy. We're on little sleep. We're on waiting in lines all day, every day. We are on just trading and talking to people all day. I'm trying to keep the energy up, but the room's dead. I think we're gonna go out for dinner. So I'm not gonna end the vlog off here. Stay here a little bit longer. I'll go through a quick Nats recap. And uh, yeah, then we gotta travel 10 hours back home tomorrow morning. I appreciate you all guys. Thank you guys all for watching and supporting the channel for so long. I guess this is an official goodbye to 2022 Nationals. It was a good event. It was a good event. I had a lot of fun. This was a great experience. One of the best I've ever had. Something that's really cool is me and the whole squad got on Konami's blog. How sick is that? That's so cool. That's me. That's me. All right, I want to do a quick recap for everything that we picked up at the event. So as you guys can see, first thing is first is this beautiful playmat with all the protagonists. But on top of that, it has the Jade and Yuki signature. The goal is to one day get it signed by all of them. But at the moment, and it's, I guess, very, very fitting for me that Jade and Yuki is the first one to sign it. So this playmat is going to mean a lot to me. This is like a prized possession for me. So first things first is these cards that I got signed by Jaden Yuki's voice actor over here. First thing is the tokens. These I'm going to be using in game, which is really, really cool. I mean, just for it to say, get your game on is so sick. I'm so excited to have these. These two as well, the tin Neos as well as what people called me crazy all weekend for is the gold stamp ultimate first edition flame wingman a lot of people were getting silver stamps signed just because they're a lot cheaper i was like no you know what this is a once in a lifetime opportunity we're gonna get the gold stamp so beautiful there you go then we didn't forget about aster because we got a ton of stuff signed here by aster as well these are all going into the gx collection so we got the destiny draw ultra first the malicious ultra first as well as the plasma we got these three three main very impactful monsters in the show and then I got these three as well. Dasher I got actually to play whenever I'm using the DPE package. Shining Phoenix Enforcer, funny enough, was one of my favorite cards growing up. I guess the whole Flame Wingman, Phoenix Enforcer line, all of that stuff I really, really liked. So I got this one for me. I got this one to play. And then I had an extra card. So I was like, you know what? Sign this Dogma for me as well. I had the opportunity, so why not? So this is all Aster Phoenix's stuff. Then of course, me and the boys got a token. But also you guys saw that opening with Ruxin. I also had a secret rare that I got signed from Ruxin. That's somewhere else. It's from the LOB 
the pack opening that we did all heavy packs by the way which was really really fun really really cool i really liked my time with ruxin that was really enjoyable and then lastly this stack of cards here which i think the trihorn is actually in here as well but i got a dt neo shout out richard he hooked me up with this one i got a metal figure thunder giant i really like the hobby league rarity on these cards so the metal figure cards are beautiful i'm happy with this one the arcane of force ex the dark ruler the old secret rares are so nice especially from light of destruction these secret rares are so pretty we got the ultimate rare topaz tiger shout out neshi one step closer to finishing the crystal beasts all i need now is an ultimate rare sapphire pegasus and we're good to go then i got a dt ojama yellow this was really nice just for the chaz collection dark paladin oh here's a trihorn by the way that we got signed by ruxin but yeah here's a dark paladin that we have this one was actually just a throw-in you guys can see it's kind of beat up but it was a throw-in in one of the trades that i got and i really like this artwork of dark paladin so i ended up getting this and of course the trihorn that we ended up using to beat ruxin in that pack battle got it signed by ruxin thank you ruxin for that and then oh baby then these three. Oh, I'm gonna put the last card to the side. I, I know you guys have seen it, but I want to talk about it separately. Here are the blue eyes, white dragon, the three of them. These cards are so beautiful. Let me know in the comment section, actually, quickly, what do you guys see the difference between these? Because there's one obvious difference. They're pretty much all the same card printed by Bandai, but this one right here is actually printed in English and it doesn't have the flavor text. It's so cool. I really like this playset. These cards are just amazingly, like, I, I don't know. You can't find blue eyes not cool, right? Especially in this kind of artwork. I love these ones. And then lastly, the holy grail of the entire weekend the card that honestly like i never thought i would own for a very long time and that is the elemental hero shining flare wingman ultimate rare first edition had the opportunity to get it at the event through trade you guys saw it in the vlog right so i'm excited that i have this finally in my collection this is a holy grail card this and the flame wingman oh my god like i was telling you guys the flame wingman and the phoenix enforcer all these lines are super cool the fact that i got a flame wingman signed by Jaden and a shining flare wingman right here this has honestly just been one of the best trips ever for me and i'm just super excited that i went to this event and i'm super grateful for everything so with that guys i'm gonna be ending the vlog right here back at home the entire journey the trip the nationals all of that was super super fun i finally got a good night's rest back in my bed which is really nice but i want to end it off here and i want to tell you guys thank you all for being part of this journey i appreciate every single one of you and without any of you guys keep this in mind without any of you guys i wouldn't be going to these kind of events i wouldn't have had the chance to meet all these people and i'm more motivated than ever to continue creating content so thank you guys all for watching i appreciate every single one of you monday we start back to our normal regular schedule i hope you guys enjoyed the vlogs i hope you guys enjoyed the trip maybe some top deck profiles coming soon as well so i hope you guys enjoyed appreciate you guys all i know i've said it a million times but i really do mean it from the bottom of my heart so thank you guys all for watching with that spanko signing out peace